What is going on guys? George here and today we're back in Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. As far as I buy summer car, I was like, whoa, wrong game. Alright, so everything in our hood, brand new. Um everything in the rear end. Brand new. So now we've gotta do the front end. We need to put a transmission and everything. I like to get all of this done because we have been working on this car for quite a while. But I don't know if we will. Let's go ahead and dismantle the whole front end. Get rid of everything. Um, let's see. I think, yeah, everything on the back is good. We don't have a transmission or anything in it, but we are going to start, you know, getting it, getting it running in order. I can't wait to see this thing. This thing's got to be a beast. It's a V12, um, just power. Plenty of power. Twin turbo. This thing goes 0 to 60 in like, I don't know, so fast people don't even know. It's like 0 to 60. This car only has two speeds, fast and <laughs> What was that? All right. I'm asking myself that. Like, you just sounded like Winnie the Pooh, George. George, you sound like Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stop right there. I'm not going to make no more weird noises. Except for this one. All right, here we go. Take that bolt out. You're out of here. Take this out. And this one. And that one. And there we go. So, let's move on to the other side. Now, this tire is actually... This is a new tire, so we're putting on it. And if you didn't see... I'll take a look over there. Over there is our new car. We're going to be... Uh, a drag car after this car but this car we're not selling because I want to keep it because well I really like Mopar and I just like this car so we're not selling it <laughs> it's, going, it's going in my collection I have already a, ch a charger that we built but this should be power more, a little bit more powerful because my other one's just a regular supercharged V8 this is a uh, twin turbo twin turbo skis turp skis Twin turp skis, uh, V12. So she might have a little power. Plus, it's all wheel drive. This thing is going to be a beast on, uh, on uh, drag racing, launching. Hopefully, hopefully it won't spin or anything. But we are. I guess what we said we'd be on a track day car, but I feel like it's going to turn to a drag car. Maybe I don't know. All right, let's go ahead. Because their other car is a drag car. It's a full blown. Like dragster and everything, so yeah. Let's go ahead and take a lot out, out, and out. So, I really want to sell everything, but I don't want to sell that rim. I will do it anyways. <coughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and start putting stuff together. We need the front steering knuckle. Steering knuckle B! Uh, that would go. Steering knuckle. Steering knuckle B. Two of those. Steering rack. We need that. Let's look at brake. Let's see. I, th I think we had two of these. Two of these. Two of these. Um. How was it? Tie rod. We need two of these. Two of these. I'm trying to think of what. I don't know which one we need. Hmm. We do need the. Uh, let's see. We got these. The front. I can't think right now. This is terrible. Let's go ahead and click on it. Type in hub. Front hub. Front hub. Wheel bearing. Wheel bearing. We need the axle. Axle! Front drop. Seriously, why are there so many? <laughs> Oops. Yeah, we do need the front cross member B. That's what I was looking for. Um, okay, apparently they cross member B. We need the bushings. I think we need three. One, two, three, four. I mean, four. Yeah, I knew. I totally have this under control. All right, let's go ahead and throw that in. Let's go. Um, 
Let's go ahead and put this in before we do anything. I have that rubber bushing. We need the what was what was front differential. The front differential. The front oops diff. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, that gonna what let's see front drive go oh, there's that many oops was it it was E wasn't it? Pretty sure. Alright, there we go. We can put that on. We can put the brakes on and stuff. I didn't bother ram or anything, so we don't have to worry about that. Alright, like I said, once we get one side built, I always buy the stuff for the other side. <laughs> Come on down. Um, voila. Alright, we need upper suspension arm and lower. Oops. Upper suspension arm. Lower suspension arm. Perfect. What? Seriously? Bottom. They're calling it the bottom. Oops. I hope that's... Oh, that going. What well, diddly diddly do? Um, back up? Seriously? I hate when it does that. It's like, okay, let me just walk back over here. Okay, so... Let's see. There it goes there. And that goes there. I can't believe I, I bought the I bought two I bought the lower arm but I need the bottom arm because you know apparently they don't like calling it the shock absorber, front shock absorber. Make sure we're wait, is this the double whisper? Okay, we about messed up. Alright, let me just make, I didn't mean to buy that many springs. Front spring. Alright. What was that? Sway bar? Sway bar. If I would buy the right daggone things. Front sway bar. Perfect. So I can do what I was doing. Alright. Let me go. Let's go. And let's go. Let's throw a cap on it. Okay. Sway bar. Link B. We need two of them, thirty-four dollars a piece. Whoa, we only have sixty-seven thousand. Yeah, I think I paid like twenty thousand for that car, that awesome drag car sitting over there. Pretty sure I paid that much for. It. Let's see, where's I think? Yeah, here it is. Perfect. I think I've rebought these rims a ton of times because I keep selling them. All right, to the other side to the other side and of course it wants us to walk all the way around all right we should have almost all the parts that we need in theory we should have all the parts that we need I'm pretty sure we're missing oil pan <laughs> okay but that is a, a whole different ball game man all right there we go and go here there this will go haw oh. perfect perfect it's like I knew what I was dealing oops all right let's go ahead and put this on put the hub on all right we're getting there there we go. Throw the brakes on. Yeah. Y'all. Alright, here we go. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Okay, we're good here. While we're here, let's go ahead and get the exhaust. Um, I don't know if we have the exhaust. What was it called? The W12? Uh, front section, yeah. Um, 
Yeah, I think, I think, I think. <gasps> Look at that. <laughs> it knows what we're doing. Okay, we need a transmission for this thing. Um, what do we, what do we need? Um, uh, we need a flywheel, gearbox, uh, transfer case, we need that. Let's put clutch. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, apparently we need a timing cover too. What does it say? W12? It's a W12. Okay, here we go. We should be good now. Alright, this motor is going to purr like a kitten. Put the clutch plate on. Put the pressure plate on. Pleasure. Put the pleasure plate on, George. All right, so we got to put this thing on. It turns and it goes clunk, 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 clunk. I used to work at AutoZone, uh, and I worked back in the back. Because I'm not a mechanic, you think, mechanic or anything. I just sent parts out. I was like, it, it's a hub, so all the other you know AutoZone part places would call. And Ayers had like a big warehouse, so I worked back there. But every now and then, you get... I'd get a call back there because where, I don't know, for some reason the air, people would get air, the hub number, and dry shaft, and people would call, and it's like, you would be amazed on what people would be like, they're like, yeah, my car is going clunk, 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 is there any way that you could, uh, you know, tell me what's wrong with it, and I, I kid you not, they'd be like, it's going clunk, clunk, click, click, clunk, clunk, click, and <laughs> there would be this, there was this one guy who worked there, and like, he would... <laughs> I don't know. It's like he knew everything about the vehicles. Well, I mean, in his mind, he did. I, I don't know anything about vehicles, so I can't be like, oh, well, you know, he don't, you know, know this or that or whatever. Do we not have any? Let's see. Um, we don't have any... I think we need this. Hmm. Anyways, like, he would... I don't know. I don't know that much about vehicles or anything like that, so I can't be like, oh, well, you know, this, this, this. But if, he, he would sit there and people would be like, well, my vehicle ain't going. He's like, all right, well, let me take a look, you know. But one of the... Th hey, there he is. We're putting crap. Where's the... Kelly converter at. Where's the cat at, man? Well, um, do they not have like the sport cat? The middle muffler. Um, I'm guessing we don't have I guess you gotta go here seriously I've never had this much trouble trying to find let's put converter converter anyway so this guy he, he I don't know he, he just he would try to sell anybody anything and I guess that's why this is this one. I guess that's you know what made him a good salesman and he one day we was back in the back in the hub that's where I work the hub and we was talking about like wonder what happens if you call him and be like yeah my car is going clunk clunk click click clunk clunk click click so <laughs> we called up front to the parts desk I called my phone and <laughs> we were he answered, I was like, yeah, so I got this, uh, I think I said it was like a, a 93 Ford truck. It's F-150. It's going click, click, clonk, clonk, click, click, clonk, clonk, clonk. And he's like, so it's going click, click, clonk, clonk, click, click, clonk, clonk, clonk. I was like, yeah, I said three, three clonks after the first two clonks. And like, he was sitting there telling me everything that was wrong with it and what I needed to buy. 
And <laughs> it's just, oh, it was just, I, and he was like really sincere about it. He was like telling you like what was wrong with your car by the click click clunk clunks. And it, I just, I don't know. That just made me think of it. But yeah. So, yeah. It was kind of funny at the time. Now I'm just like, wow, wonder if he's still selling people parts. <laughs> well, like I said, I didn't, I don't know a lot about cars either, but it just, it, it just really cracked me up when I, uh, when we called stuff. <laughs> he's like, so it's cool. Click, click, clunk, clunk, click, click, clunk, clunk, clunk. Yeah. So he was trying to sell me, yo, I don't know what it was. I think he said, you just need to put a new engine in it. Well, this thing's taking a lot of oil. Okay, I think we are done. Are we done? 98% front drive shaft. What? We're missing some stuff here. Front drive shaft. Oh, yeah. I have no clue. Okay, yeah, we're missing the drive shaft. The dry front dry shaft. Is it the dry shaft B? I mean, front dry shaft C. Golly, how many is there? Front dry shaft, dry shaft. Oh, look at that. What else are we missing? Brake servo, starter, rubber bushing. Oh, good grief. Okay, I see the starter. Oops. Starter. Oops. Come on. Perfect. Alright, so rubber bushing. Oh dear. Please tell me it's like up front somewhere. Easy to get to. Hmm. Found it. I thought I put one in there. Okay, brake servo. I say brake servo. Gotcha. Pop that hood. Just pop the hood, man. Bam. There it is. All right. So the car is complete. It's worth a hundred and sixty-five thousand dollars. Holy snap! All right, let's go see how much power put now. How much power is car putting now? All right. Wrong. Okay. Let's see. Come on, let's put a lot more. I'm the world's worst at doing this. I swear. Five's the best one I've seen. Alright, let's try it. Come on, 1,000 horsepower. Come on. Oh, golly. 1,318 horses. Woohoohoo! This thing is going to run. Alright, let's go ahead and take it and put it on the uh, path test. Might as well get all that done. And then to the drag strip we go. All right, pull frontwards. All right, hold brake. I'm holding the brake. Okay, move rear wheels. All right, let's go ahead and pull up. I'm holding the brake, I'm holding the brake. All right, move front wheels. <laughs> Look at this car, it's nice and sad. Oh my god! <laughs> it's an earthquake! It's an earthquake! We're wearing the car out already. That's what it feels like, those potholes hit the West Virginia roads, that's how they feel. Alright, we should be done for this. 100% it. It should be 100%. Alright. Let's take the car to the drag strip. Uh, drag strip. 
And let's take the all-wheel drive. Alright, time to sell it. Good grief. Golly, this thing is a monster. Holy crap. Eight? Eight gears, that's all we got. Wow. That thing, we gotta try it again. Alright, let's do this. Holy crap! <laughs> this car is a monster! Trying to get the gears right so we don't redline too much. Alright, we're in eighth gear, that's all we got. We have no more gears. Wow! This car is a beast! Holy crap, yep, it's going in my collection. Guys, what our car is done, this thing is a monster. 1,318 horses. Oh, yeah. 4.5% tuning. All of it's 100% worth $165,000. The car's not going nowhere. It's going to my... I'm just going to go ahead and put it right there. I'll definitely be putting this in my collection. Um, and then we'll be starting on this. Now, this thing is pretty bad it's um pretty bad <laughs> now this will be a full-blown dragster uh because well that's really what it is um worth sixteen thousand dollars last nine four hundred eighty eight horsepower we should jack it up some uh, it does have like the big racing slicks and stuff in the back but anyways guys i hope you enjoyed this video we'll be back to build this car in the next upcoming videos anyways guys make sure you hit that like button make sure you punch that subscribe button and as always this is george in my shiny red car and i am out of here